What's up guys, this is the Ape Man LC650 and today I'm going to share a true preview of this HD video projector. In this review I'll discuss the pros and cons of the LC650 and I'll provide a demonstration to help you decide if this projector is right for you. This projector was sent to me to test and I'll be sharing my honest feedback throughout this video. All relevant information about product placements, sponsorships and endorsements can be found in the description. This projector is currently sold on Amazon for £169.99 and it offers several desirable features, including full HD 1080p native resolution, 50 to 300 inch projection size, and a high efficiency low noise cooling system. In the box you will find the projector, a lens cap, a power cable, a HDMI cable, an AV cable, a remote control, and a user manual. The projector weighs approximately 2.2 kilograms and is 265 millimeters wide, 220 millimeters deep, and 95 millimeters tall. Due to its size and weight, I wouldn't recommend the LC650 if you're looking for a portable projector. The overall appearance and build quality of the projector is good. It has a plastic body and a brushed metal top. The lens and focus adjustment wheel is at the front of the projector, and the inputs are positioned at the rear. It has one HDMI input, two USB ports, one AV, and one 3.5mm audio interface. Although the native resolution is 1080p, the projector can support up to 4K video playback, and it can read images and video files directly from a memory stick, which is a nice feature. Other than the power button, which is located on the top, there are no other buttons or controls on the projector itself. It can only be controlled by the remote control provided. The remote has an intuitive selection of buttons, which makes it easy to navigate through the settings menu. There is an adjustable foot at the front of the projector, which enables you to change the height from 95 to 140 mm to alter the viewing angle. There are also four threaded sockets on the base of the projector to fix it to a stand or a ceiling mount. The LC650 has a sealed optical assembly, which will prevent any dust from entering or obstructing the lens. The following footage demonstrates the quality of the projector. It was positioned approximately 210cm from the wall, which produced an image size measuring approximately 160cm wide and 85cm high. When assessing the quality, I was most impressed by the clarity of the image produced. The native 1080p HD resolution provides a very detailed picture, which is enhanced by the high contrast ratio and the accurate colour reproduction. To obtain the best image quality, it is recommended to use the projector in a dark room and to project onto a white wall or screen. During testing, I positioned a backlight in the bottom right hand corner to see how the projector would perform with an external light source. Although the image was slightly washed out, the projector continued to maintain detail even in areas of dark colour. As can be seen, the settings menu is quick and easy to navigate. The digital keystone correction is a great feature, offering plus or minus 25 degree horizontal and vertical correction to ensure that your image is square. You are also able to adjust the aspect ratio of the projection, and you can change the size of the projection from 100% to 75%. Within the menu, there are a range of settings that can be used to customise the picture and sound produced by the projector. Although the quality of the inbuilt speaker system is good, I would recommend using a set of external speakers to optimise the home cinema experience. You can select different surround sound options within the settings menu, and you can also customise the treble and bass output. During testing, I measured the noise generated by the projector. Most projectors produce a noise between 30 and 35 decibels. The noise produced by the LC650 did not exceed 34 decibels, so is within the expected range. Overall, this projector has a lot to offer for the £169.99 price tag. It produces great image quality and it would be ideal for office use or within a home cinema. Thanks for taking the time to watch my review. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Have a great day.